Hello, this is God of Seven, and today we are going to be drawing images in Mono Game. Now, of course, you're going to need like your eye. I'm using Visual Studio, or your like uh, basically your program. You're also going to need the Mono Game pipeline, which I will provide in the description for Windows. And of course, you're going to need the Mono Game framework installed. So, let's start up a new Visual Studio application. I'll be right back once it loads correctly. Okay, and once Visual Studio is... boot it up we're going to create a new project once again I'll wait for this to load oh never mind and I'm going to make a mono game windows project you can select whatever you want but I'm just going to do mono game windows and I'm going to put this on my in my tutorial folder and I'm going to call this tutorial images. No images tutorial. That's better. Okay, now just leave these to the default settings, which will be fine. And just hit OK. Now, if you don't see the mono game templates, that means you don't have mono game installed. Now, this will look work for other platforms like. Linux or Mac, but obviously the steps I'm doing will be different. Okay, and you can see we have all these things here. Let's just click on the game1.cs. Now if we want to rename it, we can just do a simple rename and do like image images tutorial and basically this class is where we'll be putting most of our code and now when we run the program it'll build the output okay now if everything worked you should have gotten this screen here with the cornflower blue background we're not going to worry much about editing these window properties today, but mainly drawing images, so I'm just going to X out of that. So first, let's first get our image files. Images in this game are kind of different. You see, you don't exactly just add images, so let me just use this cl cliche Nintendo green mushroom or one up or whatever now basically I'm going to place my images in the content folder and I'm going to make a new folder called IMG I'm going to paste it there just okay I have the I didn't control X and copied it okay so now here's how I'm going to do this. You're going to double click the MGCB or open it with Mono Game Pipeline manually. And you'll see we have a blank screen here. Basically you want to add an existing folder. And you're going to add the IMG folder or whatever. And so now we have this green mushroom here and these should be good for the default settings. And you're just going to hit build. Okay, hopefully it succeeded, but once it's done you can X out of that. You have what you need. Then in the bin, windows, img, or wherever, you'll see. And you can just paste in the green mushroom.xmb in the 
content slash ing, and there you have your image. This is an image you can use. I'm going to hit reload since it's been changed, and I'm going to add in the content an existing item. Well, no, I can't really do that. Can I add an existing folder? You'd think you can add an existing folder, but I guess not. Let me just add an existing item. Content. If you don't see it, you need to go to the all files. Now we have the image there, except we kind of want a folder for it. Well, you can just shift delete the image since it's right there. Then you can add new folder. IMG. Then you can just drag it into the image. Okay, there we go. Now we have it looking how we want to. Now, here's the important part with these images. You want to hit copy if newer, because you don't want to waste time copying it every single time. And if you use the scroll box here, you want to hit content, because we're loading content here. Okay, so now in these images tutorial, how exactly do we use this image? Well, first, we need to define the texture and the rectangle we're going to draw it with. So we're going to use texture2d. And then there we go. Basically, this is the image that will be loaded, or texture, image or texture. Then I'm going to make a green shroom, shroom R, that stands for rectangle. And basically what these are going to do are, is um, variables for the image and image rectangle. Now, while this may be the image, the rectangle controls things like the x, the y, the height and width. So, now with that being said, this is where we load our content in the load content folder, so let's go and do that. We're going to say green shroom equals graphics dot 